What is this? Lazarus Wazuma V8F 3.0 Ferrari Quad Vehicle How does a Ferrari engine mate to a BMW M3 gearbox sound to you? Welcome to Fastlane TV, and today we'll talk about Lazarus Wazuma V8F 3.0 Ferrari Quad Vehicle. What can this baby produce, and how can you get your hands on it? Make sure to watch till the end to find out. So, this concept is absolutely mental for me. But it's nothing new for French custom car and motorcycle builder Lazarus. After all, it's the same company that plonked a Range Rover V8 engine into a tiny Renault Twingo. Madness is not part of their vocabulary. Quad bikes are getting more and more popular. They're great for cruising across the fields to check the vines if you're somewhere around French Alps, or hitting the dirt track for a bit of well-earned Nevada fun. Although there are pretty powerful examples, for the most part, quads cannot generate the same kind of drool as a Ducati Superbike, for instance. That's definitely not the case for Lazarus' Wazuma V8F. It's built around a 250 horsepower Ferrari 3.0-liter V8 engine and features a BMW gearbox, sports customized Brembo braking, and mono rims. As you've probably realized at this point, this unique beast of a quad doesn't come cheap. Based on the company's Wazuma R1 and built around a Yamaha R1 1000cc engine, the Wazuma V8F contains two spaced front wheels and two attached or closed wheels at the rear. Somehow, it blurs the clear lines between spider-like trikes and Venom evil-like quad bikes. It was initially created as a company showpiece and first displayed at Top Marks 2010 in Monaco. It's a Ludovic Lazarus one-off creation that features a Ferrari 3.0-liter V8 engine capable of delivering 250 horsepower, has a handlebar-controlled six-speed sequential gearbox from a BMW M3, and four made-to-measure horizontal shocks made by EMC. The Ferrari red-colored V8F quad weighs merely 650 kilograms, or 1,433 pounds, and benefits from electric power steering enhanced 18-inch mono plus power rims with slick tires, and Brembo calipers on four 324mm disc brakes. The quad has a particular suspension system consisting of four horizontal shock absorbers, made to measure by EMC. It cruises on enormous wheels, shod with slick tires, 285-30ZR18 for the front, and 315-30ZR18 for the rear. The quad is said to incorporate the injection system of two sport bike engines, electronically controlled by a Cybel system. There are also eight intake funnels for four exhaust outlets and a vast cooling radiator. Engine management can be changed via computer. Custom car and motorcycle maker Lazarus is based in Annecy, France and is no stranger to demanding top prices for its custom creations. It has quite an exotic vehicle portfolio and includes designing and building the FZR Turbo Motorcycle for the blockbuster Babylon AD and the supercharged Buell XB12S that impressed us back in 2007. The company's Wazuma V8F can be bought for the astronomical asking price of 200,000 euros or $261,000. It's only a few thousand euros less than the Ferrari 458 Spider sports car quoted European price. Still, with the latter, you'll get a sports car boasting a 4.5 liter V8 engine, a top speed of just under 200 miles per hour or 320 kilometers per hour, and protection from less than dry weather conditions in the form of an automated folding aluminum hardtop roof. You can only reach that speed on a drag strip since the one-off vehicle is not street legal in France. There's also the latest Ferrari-engined version, the V8F Matte Edition, 
They might as well name it the Quad from Hell, since it looks precisely like that. Features are pretty much the same. The machine is based on the Wazuma R1, the same model but with a Yamaha R1 engine. The Matt edition boasts a 3.0-liter Ferrari V8 engine, mated to a six-speed sequential gearbox taken from a BMW M3 in place of the motorcycle unit. However, it is offered in black, has electric power steering, modified 18-inch mono rims, and slick tires, plus Brembo brake calipers with 324mm discs. The 3.0-liter Ferrari engine has been modified with fuel injection controlled by a Cybel system. The V8 engine can produce around 250 horsepower and has been modified to hold the injection system of two Yamaha R1 engines. The gearbox electronic management is totally revised, with gear selection being made from the handlebars. Eight fuel intakes, four exhaust outlets, and a massive radiator for cooling. You can also change the engine's performance by reprogramming the onboard computer. Power is supplied to the rear wheels by a BMW M3 six-speed transmission. Okay, you might be wondering now, why am I lusting over this four-wheeled French oddity? Just think about it, it's got a damn Ferrari engine. The company's already legendary founder, Ludovic Lazarus, found himself with a complete 3184cc motor from a vintage 328 GTS, but nowhere to place it. So he used all the creativity nature gave him and created something entirely new around it. In the end, we got this Franco-Italian monster. The monster got 250 horsepower, weighs 1,433 pounds, and is capable of 155 miles per hour. These induction trumpets you see on the footage sit just inches from the rider's chin. Yup, it's death to your beard, but it's also the greatest Italian soundtrack you can come up with. It runs through a BMW M3 SMG transmission with handlebar-mounted gear shifts. The machine rides on bespoke Allens dampers, Brembo-sourced four-piston calipers, and custom 18-inch wheels with a 315-section rear Michelin Pilot Sports footprint. If we believe Mr. Lazarus, almost everything on the Wazuma V8F is homemade. From the aluminum swing arms to the fiberglass body panels, the composite trim, and the wild ducting. Oh, and if you're still wondering, that odd shape is intentional so that the Wazuma V8F can comply with regulations for a trike. It is just over 1 meter in front and 460 centimeters out back. Before you jump in with a checkbook in hand, you might want to contact your local transport authority and make sure that the V8F is road legal where you want to ride it. Lazarus has already succeeded it on its home turf, as you can see from the video footage of the Wazuma V8F on the road. That's all for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss an upload, and you can enjoy the excellent content we send your way.